So I just want to take a moment to, to describe some of the papers that go into the, the three absolute Andalian geometry papers. This is uh, pretty difficult for me to follow um, because what, what will happen is uh, you'll go look for a result in, say, the absolute Andalian geometry three paper and here, and it'll be about something about cusps, okay? About the reconstruction of cusps. And so what ends up happening when you when you read this paper, right, you'll you'll go look and it'll say, okay, go to absolute Andalian geometry two and and go look up corollary three point seven and this will have what you have. But uh, once you once you go back here, uh, you'll find that this will send you back to to a result for for uh, an absolute Andalian geometry one, which is lemma four point five uh, V or four point five point five. Okay, and uh, this lemma 4.5.5 is kind of a very typical idea, and this will send you back to um, another paper back here, uh, back to 2007, um, which, uh, you know, is, is states a version of this. But this isn't really, when you go look at the proof, this isn't, okay, the, first of all, it has lots of uh, terminology that you need about uh, semigraphs of anabelioid, so you think maybe that you want to go back uh, here to this paper, which is in, in 2006, where, where some of these ideas were, were first introduced. But actually, um, uh, some of these ideas are, are spelled out a little bit better uh, here. The reconstruction of cusps is, is spelled out a little bit better, oh, sorry, not this, not this paper, um, but uh, in this paper here, which appears in a uh, Springer book, uh, this is quite a nice paper here. Um, and if you actually look a little bit further, th these ideas are actually influenced by an earlier paper of Nakamura. Uh, and these are, so this is, in this particular instance, I'm talking about the reconstruction of, uh, of cuspidal decomposition, or, or, yeah, cuspidal decomposition and inertia groups uh, from uh, a Galois, just from your, your fundamental group. Okay, and so uh, this is kind of interesting. Um, so this is one thread that I, I, that I wanted to mention. There's another one that happens, and this is where you can start to think about where, where Coomer classes appear. Um, so, you know, you, you see the statement about Coomer classes here and in the Atal Theta paper, and you wonder, okay, so where do these come from? Well, the first time they're really explained is in this this paper here, this this absolute. So this is for Coomer classes. So they're spelled out first here in these absolute uh, anabelian or absolute anabelian cuspidalization of proper hyperbolic curves. But really, um, it it goes back to uh, further. Let's see where where was the first? So they first appear in uh, this this Gawa sections paper here. So this is kind of influences this paper a bit, and uh, and then I guess they're really used in the full force in the the tall theta paper. But when you go and try and look at some of the descriptions and things, it's it's better to go back to the earlier papers. Even also, I should say that these the statements about cusps and decomposition groups are here, uh, and then uh, what's finally needed is there's well what's finally needed is more than all this, but we need to eventually do all these things over various fields. So you need to do them over uh, a field K where K is, is uh, you know, can be a finite extension of Q. So it could be like a number field, or it could be an extension of a piatic field. So it could be a, a piatic field. So, or, so by piatic field, I mean a finite extension of QP. And then, uh, or, or you could, uh, See, these two are, I guess, but then you would also want uh, profinite and tempered versions. So, again, the tempered version was first uh, dealt with here. Okay? But all these, these results are essentially sourced, or, or essentially kind of compiled in these papers, while many of the proofs appear much earlier in these papers. And so, uh, I, I don't know, I... I want to indicate um, what's going on here, so I'm going to, I'm going to get, kind of give some samples of, of some of the things that are happening in these previous papers. Uh, hopefully this is helpful.